brand new episode of Hollywood Reports. Here are today's top stories. Get ready because Tom Hanks is starring in a brand new movie called Here, directed by Robert Zemeckis, coming to theaters November 15th, 2024. And you better watch out, you better not cry, you better not pound, I'm telling you why. Dwayne The Rock Johnson is coming to town. That's right, The Rock is starring in an upcoming Christmas movie called Red One with Chris Evans. Also in theaters November 15th, 2024. And coming October 4th, it's White Bird. This is the sequel to the 2017 hit Wonder. Well, everyone, Will Smith is set to perform a brand new song at this weekend's BET Awards. In Taylor Swift news, her background musicians are such parts of her performances that she has group names for them and has them appear in her music videos, despite Dave Grohl saying that they don't perform live. Seriously, Dave Grohl? Travis Kelsey has opened up about his relationship with Taylor Swift and why he's not going to hide his love for her. All right, it's time to look back on the Tony Awards. Daniel Radcliffe won his first Tony Award. Congratulations! The Outsiders won a Tony for Best Musical. And I am very happy because I'm going to be seeing it this summer. Jay-Z and Alicia Keys reunite for a performance of Empire State of Mind at the Tonys live in New York. In other news, Carol Burnett got her hand and footprints done at the TLC Chinese Theater in Los Angeles in an event hosted by Jimmy Kimball. Hey, we're so glad we had this time together. While well, Justin Timberlake is set to continue his world tour this Friday in Boston, despite his recent arrest, his wife said she was disappointed. Why, Justin, why? Travis Scott was also arrested for trespassing and public intoxication. Hey, at least Cody is joining you in prison. All right, it's time for my movie review on Inside Out 2. The plot of this movie follows Riley as a teenager, and we meet many new characters in this new film, like anxiety and envy and embarrassment. And there's also a new character, Pouchy, who is a combination of toodles from Mickey Mouse Clubhouse and Backpack from Dora the Explorer. Oh, Pouchy! What did you think of the movie? I thought it was a great film. 10 out of 10. We're also getting a Spaceball sequel. Yep, Josh Gad confirmed that he will star in the long-awaited follow-up to the 1987 classic with Mel Brooks returning as director. And returning this fall on NBC is Reba McIntyre's Happy Place. Be sure to see the 50th season of Saturday Night Live coming this fall. And the 50th anniversary special will be in February of 2025. So exciting! Meanwhile, the Bunked series finale will air on July 5th at 7 p.m. Bye-bye, Kiki Waka. We'll miss you. Time for box office movie records. Inside Out 2 has made over $350 million at the box office, followed by Bad Boys, Ride or Die, with around $150 million. And lastly, we'd like to remember the legendary actor Donald Sutherland with a moment of silence. Well, that's all for this week's episode of Hollywood Reports. Remember to grab a popcorn and to your pals, Cody, Gizmodi, and Harley, the dog, and head to your local movie theater. Hollywood!